Hi, I'm Kevin Unix with the Xbox team. And I'm here to show game streaming on Windows 10 from Xbox One. Cool. So what we have here running is our Xbox One, uh -huh. our big screen TV connected, and over here we've got our Windows 10 machine with the built-in Xbox app. Mm -hmm. Logged in as me and my gamer tag. Okay. You see over here, it's, it's me, it's my real gamer score. I got access to all my same friends that I would have on the Xbox, mm -hmm. uh, Xbox Live today. I can go down and I can play, uh, I can see game recordings people have made. What we're showing here today for the first time is the ability in this Xbox app is to help, in addition to having constant connection with friends, being mm -hmm. able to communicate, to be able to bring those games with you, the games that you care about, on your Windows 10 PC anywhere in your house. Okay. So I click on this connected button. Mm -hmm. It's discovered that I have an Xbox One. I previously said I want to connect to this Xbox One. Okay. Showing me what's running on the Xbox One. And then all I do is I click on this button called Stream. Connects to my Xbox One over my home network. The console says that my gamer tag has started streaming. Mm -hmm. Paul's going to launch the game here. Okay. Uh, now, and he's playing Sunset Overdrive. Only available today on the Xbox One. And he's getting a... He uh, failed. Uh, which is fun. Failing in Sunset Overdrive is a blast. Because yeah. it respawns are always... It seems insane. to be running uh, pretty much uh, in sync. Like, yeah, pretty much the same time. Yeah, it's a full fidelity yeah. experience. In mm -hmm. fact, you can see... You know, if you didn't look at the television, this right. looks exactly like... And you can actually see them both. Mm -hmm. You're seeing great performance. This is a Core i5, so this uh -huh. is some... You know, mm -hmm. ridiculously outlined uh, high end gaming PC. Mm -hmm. um, it's really. Just, it's designed to mirror that experience and make it. Uh, gotcha. make is it anything easier. lost in the streaming transition? No, the, the way we've designed the, the, uh, the technology is so it's a full fidelity experience. It should be, and we encourage you to try it. Uh -huh. You should feel as responsive as if you were sitting at the console. Cool. It's connected to, yeah, just playing with the normal yeah, Xbox and, controller. And the controller is actually plugged into the USB hub on the surface. Uh huh. Just so you know we're not. Uh, right, you see right. And at any time, he could also walk to the Xbox One and, and, uh, and take over there as well. So actually, Paul cool. can jump up on the train, and turn around, and you can see that, I think, you get the idea. Oh, he's going to convert. Yeah. And if he pauses, just to show again, I can hit escape, and I'm back in the application. Uh -huh. It's asking me, as part of our feedback program, how was it? And I'm back. I'm still sitting here running Windows. I could have anything running in the background. I've got Steam installed. And just in and out. Very seamless to have that constant access to your games from any Windows 10 PC. Very nice. And will this support all games? Yeah. The design goal is that every Xbox One game uh, is available to stream and works well. Right Excellent. And when, do you, when is the feature going to be available? Is it for Windows 10 launch? Yeah. This, this will be available for Windows 10 launch. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Meet the Watch. It's the first wearable Apple's ever made and a device poised to put its competition to shame. That makes it a pretty big deal. 